Okay, Charles, I've got a little video here that I want to uh, make, and I'm going to upload this to YouTube and send you the link so that you can uh, look at it for yourself and see. Uh, this is your onboard glow driver, and I have I've checked it from one end to the other, upside down and backwards, and I just can't find anything wrong with it. Um, this is your battery. This is your glow driver. Uh, I'm using a serv one of my servo testers uh, for the signal, so I don't have to have a transmitter and receiver. And what I've done is I've got two uh, glow plugs screwed into this uh, glow plug wrench. And as you can see, I've got it grounded. And I wanna show you here, I've got this thing set to come on at half throttle. And I'm gonna show you that the glow plugs come on and they're, they're bright, they're as bright as they should be, but they're not too bright and it's not burning them out. Um, I don't know why you might have been having the trouble that you were having unless maybe your glow plugs were damaged or maybe unless they were old or something. Um, but uh, these are not new glow plugs. I don't know if they've ever been running an engine or not, but they're not new. They're OS, I think these are OS 8s, but I've been using them to test uh, glow drivers and things for years and years and years, and uh, I'm going to turn them off here, and <clears throat> they've they've spent a lot of time on, so they're, they're not new, but I'll turn them on again and let you see. Um, they are, they're doing fine. Your, your glow driver's working fine. Um, the only thing I can suggest maybe is that if you're going to test them, it's, it says this in the instruction, but I think you said something that made me uh, believe that you already knew that you have to have them both connected because if you don't, the current going to just one is too much. Um, I'm turning them off again so I don't run your battery down. Um, but you may, uh, you may uh, have accidentally not had one connected or something and that will that will pop the one that's uh, still connected. The only other thing, I'm turning back on again, the only other thing that uh, I can think of might be um, if you don't have the glow plugs uh, screwed into a wrench or something like this where maybe they can get rid of a little heat if they're just laying out in the open and you've got them grounded with a wire or something, that might let a glow plug get too hot if you leave it on for too long. But I would just I would just recommend that you make sure your glow plugs are in good shape. And if you're gonna test them outside the cylinder, just test them for a second or two to make sure that they're coming on and everything is okay. And then screw them back into the, the cylinder so that um, they are not exposed to to cold air or drafts or anything like that. Um, but as you can see, they you know they're working great. So I'm gonna I'm gonna upload this uh, video to YouTube and send you the link so you can have a look at it and you can be confident that everything is working okay. And then if you keep having trouble, uh, give me a call and we'll see if we can explore some other uh, option for you. So. Just wanted to let you have a look at this. Okay, I'll get this boxed up and headed back your way, Charles. Thanks.